Hello again, welcome back. Digital sales of music, games and films topped a billion pounds for the first time in 2012, meaning a quarter of the entertainment market is now digital. Traditional disc sales fell by almost 18%, signalling more bad news for high street shops. Our business correspondent, Poppy Trowbridge, reports now on the download revolution. From fantasy to football, digital downloads of video games are on the rise. No! 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 More music and movies are also being bought in their electronic form, and that's pushed spending on digital entertainment to more than a billion pounds for the first time ever. In the past, the entertainment industry has struggled to adjust to the digital age. And CDs and DVD sales still make up the majority of the entertainment market. But as digital grows, it's the high street that could suffer as consumers are increasingly tempted by electronic entertainment. Of all digital formats, video showed the sharpest increase in sales in 2012 with 98 million pounds spent on downloading films. That's 20% more than the previous year. Music was up 15%, with total sales of 383 million pounds. While video games saw an almost 8% increase to more than 550 million pounds. But physical sales of CDs, DVDs and Blu-rays fell by 17.6%. Some consumers still value an album or film that they can hold in their hand. If you lost your online thing, then it's gone, isn't it? Whereas this is physical, so you can't, it's so much harder to lose it. I find that if you buy it online, it's so easy for it to just get deleted. I prefer to have the physical uh, movie. Why? Because, um, sort of, uh, not being sure about digital. Those not sure about new technology can still come to the high street shops for now. That may change. There's a huge proliferation of digital services out there now where people can buy music, film, games, um, and that's coupled with increasing ownership of things like tablets and smartphones, which make it possible for people to consume this content wherever and whenever they want. They want convenience and portability. And while the entertainment industry may not have driven the switch to digital, it is catching up. Poppy Trowbridge, Sky News. Time for a roundup.